His Excellency President Museveni, outgoing chair of the summit of heads of state of, of the East African community for steering well the organization for the last two years. Allow me to take this opportunity to express our solidarity with the President of Kenya, President Uhuru, and the people of Kenya in the fight against terrorism. It is an honor to serve as the chairperson of our summit for the next year. I look forward to working together with my fellow leaders to serve the people of East Africa. This summit comes at an important moment as we approach the 20th anniversary of the revival of the East African community. We have much to celebrate, but it is also a moment to reflect on the meaning and value of this community, which is important to all of us. It is an opportunity to address whatever challenges exist directly and frankly so that we can move confidently together into the future. Africa is moving ahead with deeper integration as are other regional economic communities which are essential building blocks of continental integration. We cannot afford to fall behind, particularly when the East African community was starting to make good progress. It is up to us to ensure that this community works for us as it should. Nothing should hold us back from the important business that we have committed to for our collective good, including trade, infrastructure, industrialization, and security. As leaders of the community, we therefore need to come together in a spirit of solidarity and unity for the benefit and well-being of the citizens of our region. Our treaty is clear that the East African community is people-centered. This should inform all our reflections and actions. We will measure success by how easily our people, their goods and capital move within our region and how prosperous in the end they become as a result. Excellencies, this is our task. I know we are equal to it if we choose to put all our energies into making it happen. I thank you very much for your kind attention, Asante Nisang.